Hello and welcome to Overdrive. I am Onijit and I am back with more facts and insights on automobiles. Today I am glad to call it the first part of our first two part episode of the tech series. And today we are talking safety in vehicles. In the past, the basic safety features cars used to have are the basic three point seat belts gifted to the auto world by Volvo. With time and innovation today, we have cars and motorcycles with advanced safety measures attached to them. Essentially, safety measures fall in two categories such as active safety measures and passive safety measures. Active safety measures are the ones which continuously monitor the car and assist the driver to drive safe and avoid collision or accidents. Passive safety measures are the ones which help keep the occupants of the vehicle safe and minimizes injury in case of a collision or accident. On this episode, let's check out the active safety measures vehicles have in them today. ABS with EBD. The terms mean anti-lock braking system and electronic brake force distribution and these two work in harmony as an essential safety measure for all vehicles. When you suddenly apply brakes to your car and need to steer clear, the wheels could get locked and this could cause an accident. ABS prevents that from happening and ensures that you have better control over the car. EBD takes over when it's time to re-engage the brakes. It decides how much braking pressure each tire can take and accordingly applies that much braking force to each individual wheel. This allows each wheel to brake in the most efficient manner possible and ensures smoother and safer maneuverability. ESC Electronic stability control is almost self-explanatory. This feature helps the driver to maintain grip on the road during hard maneuvers and electronically maintains the vehicle's stability. ESC stops a vehicle from spinning its tires or skidding over low friction surfaces and also helps the vehicle maintain its line when going through a corner. The ESC system in the car gathers information through multiple sensors which are placed in the wheels and steering wheel and the computer uses the information to assist the driver. TPMS Tire pressure monitoring system is a very important safety feature in vehicles today. This monitors the tire pressure of the vehicle real time constantly and notifies the driver in case of any irregularities. This helps in avoiding accidents and keeps the driver informed of the conditions of the wheel at all time. ADAS Short for Advanced Driver Assistance Systems, this includes a host of features which helps the driver in avoiding difficult situations and crashes. ADAS uses cameras, sensors, radar and LiDAR to prevent deaths and the injuries by reducing the number of car accidents and the serious impact of those which cannot be avoided. Let's check out the most popular ADAS features which we see in cars right now on the Indian roads. Adaptive Cruise Control First came the cruise control, where technology allowed the driver to lock the vehicle at a selected speed and it will continue to run on that specified speed till brakes are applied or gears are shifted manually. This was succeeded by adaptive cruise control, where the vehicle now equipped with sensors can detect other vehicles on the road and maintain steady distance while cruising on the road at a steady speed. Another sensor-based feature, generally available in premium vehicles, this senses the movement of the vehicle with the help of cameras in case of a sudden lane change. These cases generally happen when the driver is somehow inattentive towards driving for even a second. LDW warns the driver about the sudden lane change and this keeps the vehicle and the other vehicles on the road safe and avoids accidents. Usage of cameras and sensors gives the driver a complete view of the vehicle and its surroundings. This alerts the driver in case of a sudden chance of collision and crash. As the name suggests, this feature of ADAS decelerates the vehicle and applies the brakes automatically when it detects a potential collision and there is no or slow action from the driver. The driver monitor system detects the attentiveness of the driver. 
The process is done by a closed circuit camera mounted on the steering. The camera tracks the condition of the driver's eyes through infrared LED detectors. If the driver is feeling drowsy, it gets detected by the camera and the system flashes lights or warns them via a high-pitched beep sound. Well, that's our bit on active safety features. I'll see you next week when we talk about passive safety features present in vehicles of now. Till then, hit the like button and subscribe to the YouTube channel of Overdrive and follow us on Instagram. I'll see you next week. Mm.